Hi folks, it's Max from GalaxyS2.com. Um, so I've got quick updates on the Jedi Mind Trick Jelly Bean ROM by uh, XDA user PTMR3. You can also follow him on Twitter at uh, twitter.com slash PTMR3. Um, definitely nice. It's been, uh, this ROM has been uh, polished and I didn't do a video overview when it got updated uh, with performance. Um, but I've got the latest version 4 now. Version 4 is better than ever, super fast. And also does come with Jedi Kernel. I've got it overclocked to 1.836 gigahertz. It runs super smooth, super fast, just like you had it uh, when um, Jedi Mind Trick came out with ICS. Um, some of the settings, oh, let me go over Advanced S here. You can change your buttons, your shortcuts up there, uh, here. Um, change the order if you want GPS first. Boom, there you go. And um, it does come with Awesome Beats, which is great. Uh, addition over stock. And uh, let me show you settings. Jedi Mind Trick again. ROM Trick, so, sorry. And uh, you'll be able to change your battery bar. Use a battery bar, you know, those things that come out. And also you can enable um, exposed app settings. Frame. You'll have to install the uh, install and update, reboot once, enable the expose app uh, a module there, reboot, and then you'll be able to go into per app, DPI settings, run your favorite apps in tablet phone mode. I have a full tutorial guide on that so you can follow that and also LMT launcher if you want uh, LMT um, you can get it here and enable all your shortcuts over here. I also have a full tutorial on that, follow that and also icon changer there. Um, pretty nice and uh, it's been completely debloated from stock Jelly Bean and also you'll get Walkman app uh, which works very nice uh, for music and mobile hotspot has been hacked with the tethering provision removed um, there we go and uh, pretty nice ROM and let me show you lock screen settings here does it have lock screen options let me see uh, ripple effect, yes, there's ripple effect. We, um, very nice ROM. I think this is probably the best ROM if you're looking for uh, stability of stock. Yet you want uh, Wi-Fi calling, and uh, you want a couple some tricks up your sleeves, and uh, uh, if you want super fast speeds on Jelly Bean, definitely Jedi Mind Trick uh, is the way to go, and you can't go wrong with this. So check it out for this week's ROM of the Week. Um, latest version comes with Jedi Kernel, and uh, very nice, another great job. And don't forget to donate to the developer of this ROM, PTMR3. I always have a link to the XDA thread. You can uh, find the Donate to Me link on the upper left-hand corner of XDA. Um, you know, uh, if you don't want to donate, then you can hit the Thanks button. They have Thanks button. You can thank uh, PTMR3. Also, and uh, yeah, pretty awesome ROM. And uh, again, you know, this is probably one go to ROM. If you're running stock or if you're running, you know, if you don't know where you're doing, install this ROM. It will fix your phone. And uh, yeah, that's about it. And as always, if you have a Galaxy S2, any of the Galaxy S2s, um, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxyst2root.com. And the flash bar, transparent flash bar is here, but multi window doesn't work, so don't try it. You'll get a force close. Uh, but it's there, and hopefully it's coming soon. And also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here, subscribe button down there. And if you have any other cool ROMs you've tried on the SGHT 989, um, don't forget to leave it in the comment section. I like to check out new ROMs. And also, uh, if you're looking for some good AOSP ROMs, try uh, AOKP MR1 Milestone one. That's a very good go-to ROM also. That one or this one is my favorite, probably for T989. Anyway, thanks you guys. See y'all later. Um, stay high on Android.